We continue to take a look at the propositions on the November 8th ballot. CBS 13's Tony Lopez tackles two of them this evening, both dealing with a familiar topic. It's all about money for propositions 55 and 56. One would hike up the cost of smokes by two bucks per pack. The other would keep an existing income tax on the books. It would only affect about the top one and a half percent of taxpayers. Uh, but of course, the school funding and, and potentially, uh, you know, the, the health care funding would, would affect far more voters. He's talking about Proposition 55, which would extend an already existing measure approved by voters back in 2012. Increasing taxes for anyone making $250,000 a year or more in California. The increase would be for the next 12 years and directs that money into certain areas like school and community colleges, uh, health care programs for low income Californians, um, and increased uh, budget reserves and, and uh, debt payments at the state level. Who's pushing this prop? Everyone from the California Medical Association to the California Labor Federation to more than 40 local school districts and community colleges. Those opposed to Prop 55 say this just amounts to a tax hike that was supposed to be temporary. They call it unfair. Now, speaking of taxes, let's get over to a smoking hot debate over an increase in cigarette tax. Prop 56 would add two bucks per pack of cigs. Right now, the tax is 87 cents per pack. And the same $2 increase would be tacked onto other tobacco products along with those e-cigarettes. The extra revenue would go towards things like cancer research, treatment of dental diseases, heart and lung disease research, and tobacco use prevention programs at schools. In some cases it would be new, new money to support existing programs, in other cases it might be for newer programs depending on how the departments implement according to the measure. So who's pushing this prop? The California Democratic Party, the Campaign for Tobacco-Free Kids, the California School Board Association, and the Sierra Club, just to name a few. Those against Prop 56, which includes the California Taxpayers Association, call the measure, quote, a $1.4 billion tax height grab by insurance companies and other wealthy special interests to dramatically increase their profits. And just a reminder, you can find a simple explanation of all of the propositions on our website by